Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 5 of Let's Play Neo 2 Darkness in the Capital DLC. However, right, we are still in the Twilight Mission, the Mystery of Rashomon, since, well, obviously we just entered there. Okay, that's just a bunch of Amrita memories, and for some reason I'm seeing builds again. <laughs> Funny, I thought I already had the tutorial for builds at the time. Skill customization, not gonna bother with that. Figured I'd just enter this Twilight Mission now since it's in the rotation. Wow. Oof. Okay, I got corrupted. You gotta be careful with these. Just gotta wait for this corruption to wear off. Whoa! That's a new attack. I don't remember it charging that quick. Okay, I'm tilting hard against this, uh, cart. Oof. I had to use up a lot of my, uh... I had to use up a lot of my elixirs for that one. Wow. Also, the Yasakani Makatama that I have... I got that put through a Stone of Penance, so let's see if we can get that upgraded. I would like for that to happen. I don't know if it will. I think it said I like a not the odds of 70. So I don't know if that means 70% that it will increase in value when I get this stone of penance cashed in. We'll find out. I mean last time I used it it didn't work. Like I didn't get the dice roll I hoped. Guess we'll just keep killing Yokai along the way. I guess I don't have to worry about getting Kadama this time, because I got them all. So let me guess, I gotta deal with a Yasha here too? You wouldn't be surprised. They're gonna like throw one of those in in a Twilight mission. Also, I made sure that I took a lot of the soul cores I'm not using anymore and performed resting rites. That'll free up some inventory space, for sure. Hello. Oh, nice. Oh, that, that was not nice. That was not nice. That was not nice at all. Maybe be a little bit more careful, alright? Obviously, that's not the cause of the corruption here. That must be the Yasha. No, what? That's an Abume! Did I just do a counter and I didn't even know I could? Because usually I miss the prompt every time. This will not be. Especially if I can poison her. Now, if I can just set her on fire, that would work too. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. I camped in a corner. That's not where you want to be fighting a yokai like this. Or, you know, fight a yokai anywhere. But anyway, I haven't even found the, uh, one of the gates to open yet. Unless it's right here. It may not even be where I need to go. <laughs> In the grand scheme of things. Could go back for that chest. Actually, this looks like I just went in a circle. Oops. <laughs> That's not where I need to go. 
I tend to get confused about this spot, not gonna lie. It's happened many times before. It's probably gonna happen again. Hello. And goodbye soon-ish. That grab is coming, and that grab is gone. It doesn't exist anymore. Well, there's no grab. What are you talking about? <laughs> I don't see a grab. Okay, maybe don't fight this Yasha while you're on fire. Just a thought. I wonder if it has, like, new combat techniques in a Twilight mission. Oh! Didn't know that second swing was coming. Oh, great. Now somebody else is aggroed. Wow! They all hit me right there! And I get hit in midair. Fuck. Oh, huh. good thing I got away from that. Wow! Oh, what, that was an aberrant that hit me? <laughs> I didn't even know what that was. I was also aggroed. Well, it looks like I probably made little to no progress outside of nullifying a dark realm. God damn it. All right, now I gotta. Now I just gotta run away from everything. Well, except for this guy, he's in the way. That was actually my first death in this DLC. In a mission, I. In a mission, I didn't even have to do. Couldn't catch a break against that Yasha because I had backup. <laughs> Oh well. Mistakes were made. <laughs> Let's try this again. At least this play works every time. So let me guess. Maybe I should not go into the fire this time? Try a different approach. You know what? I'm not gonna bother with that different approach. Let's just go back through the fire. Ah, shit. I actually didn't want to face the Asha that time yet. I was more interested in facing the Aberrant. Like, take out the Sniper, and then kill the Asha. But it looks like I have to do the opposite of that now. And at least it worked. <laughs> Alright, good stuff. Well, if I'm going up this rubble, I must be pretty close to the second shrine. I believe I just had to go up, like, another wall. Don't aggro this wheel monk too. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I was on the path of the wheel monk the whole time. There was no avoiding it. I thought I was just gonna turn around. Nope. This is where I'm going, whether you like it or not. Get out of here, you. Okay. I think we calmed things down a little. 
Hello. Oof, good thing I blocked that. Look, I can swing my weapon around too. Let's go. Ha <laughs> Can't stand the heat? Get out of the uh, land of the living. <laughs> Really, you can consider this a land of the living. It's a twilight after all. Wow, that beam goes a long time. Oh my god, look at that neck. I didn't think his neck was that long. Jesus, these guys hit so hard. Oh my god, I almost died here, too. Like, that close to a shrine. Imagine if I just kicked the bucket right there. Huh. I would have been so upset. <laughs> okay, alright. I mean, I could level up if I offered some more, but you know what, let's just keep going. Nice, we actually had the same idea with a charge attack. Oops. Oops. I thought I'd kill him just before he got me. That did not work. <laughs> Alright, new plan. Don't die. <laughs> you know. Uh, to win at certain shoot 'em ups, the best tip is not get hit. Well, thanks, genius. Never would have thought of that. Why did the sound effect cut out? That was weird. You noticed that, right? Like, the first few shots of my projectile just didn't have a sound effect. I don't know if that was supposed to happen, but it did. Where are we going? Oh, this guy? Dude, take a hint. I'm not gonna let you shoot me, okay? Get out of here, Shack Dweller. Oh, wow. <laughs> Good thing I sidestepped, because he was not selling. That dweller just exposed the business. I'm not happy about that at all. Okay, let's take a look at my uh, stone. It's not even close to filling up. Oh, that wasn't you that was aggro? Yeah, I'll get you right in the kneecap. No, I'll get you right in the stomach. Oh, another spider. And they're still throwing like a fair amount of yokai at me. He's, I wonder if I could actually just got by her or something. Because she seemed intent on leaving me alone. You know, until I took down her Emrita baby. Okay, let's just take this carefully. I don't want to get stunned again. At least this is quite open. I don't remember, like, uh, in the base game, hitting a Boomaze is almost impossible. Because they always got away from your hits. Then again, my weapon is a short-range weapon, so... <laughs> I mean, I should have come to expect that. But not to the degree that was happening. That was a little much.
I better have this active. And... There we go, the Aberrant's dead. Okay, why does the sun does the spider care about this? Like, why were you aggroed? You're a spider. Shouldn't you just be eating flies? Just saying. This is not your problem. Yeah, this thing's almost down. See, that spider didn't care. Like, she's just minding her business. But she dies for it anyway, because that's how I roll. <laughs> All right, this way. Uh, big spider. No thanks. If I don't have to fight you, I just won't. I did not think that would actually work. <laughs> Somehow it did. I thought she'd just see me there. Hello, can I help you? Might I suggest death? Here you go, it's yours now. Okay. Okay, I remember it was yellow in the regular stage. And it's the same thing here, too. I hear a Biwa. Let's see where it is. Unless it's in this tunnel at the end. Wait, maybe it's right here. Freebird! You didn't play Freebird, so now you have to die for it. How does that make you feel? To know you could have prevented this. Okay, decisions, decisions. Well, this is pretty much a dead end, but I don't trust this wheel monster. Well. Okay, so we Ow. Why are you trying to heat me up? What am I, a coffee that you saved for all morning and then you're gonna have in the afternoon? Like, I've had coffee before that gets a bit cold, you know, if you take too long to drink it. But I never really thought of, you know, heating it up in the microwave. And I've known people that do that. Like, it just feels like, okay, it's already cold, so this is my fault. So I'm gonna have to, uh, commit to it. Like, I never really thought of, you know, heating it up, you know what I mean? Like, I just try to drink it as I have it. And if I can't, well, there's nothing I can do about it. I mean, iced coffee is a thing after all. Okay, if I go around this way, I should be pretty close to the uh, next save point. Might want a barrier for this. Maybe not for this guy. But he's just in the way. Oh, that was a miss. Whoa, okay. I didn't think you'd just get that many attacks in a row. Oh, I got the Yasha Cutter title. Fantastic. Now I just gotta find the yokai responsible for this.
Or, you know, I could just soak in the hot spring and get extra benefits right away. So I will. Alright, good stuff. Good stuff. This will make things a little bit easier, I hope. Oh, did I lose my barrier over a freaking rock? No, I guess it was the Asha. And this guy has to exacerbate it. Got his ass. Wait. Hello? What a weird fall. Like, he was just hanging. I hit him with a, a kunai. And he falls upward. And then down, of course. Because that's how gravity works. But that doesn't explain flying upward in the first place. That was weird. Okay, so the Tengu is the cause of the Dark Realm. Oh, great. Wait. I thought somebody else was coming. I could have swore I saw a dweller. I think that was a dweller. Like a big one? I. I went in the grab anyway? Are you kidding me? There, got him with the poison. Yeah, that was a large dweller. Alright, let's just run to the save point first. <laughs> I'm not interested in hunting down lots of loot. Dang, all I need to do is just beat the boss and we're on our way. Hopefully I can get a new shifting level soon. It's been a while since that happened. Now let's see here. I could go for some more dexterity. And let's see, which way do I go to face the boss? Right beyond here. There. I'll do it so this guy doesn't notice. Work like a charm. Alright, Suchi Gumo, round two. Oh, I missed the sloth. Whoa, okay, no, no. Not cool. I don't like being slow like this. Damn it! Okay, don't let me fall so I can come back. Sure, I, d I don't mind. Great, so now I really gotta learn his pattern. Or just shift. That works too. Okay, that slam is going to be tricky to dodge. Because even if you dodge the roll, the earth... Oh my god, he killed me again? This guy's not giving me many breaks. Okay, you can dodge it. I think you guys roll forward. I noticed in the Twilight Mode, he's... Are you kidding me? I noticed in Twilight Mode, he's doing the grab more often. Like, it was just constantly, like, grab, and then half a second later, grab. He's fierce in this one. Yeesh. Okay, we're gonna beat this guy this time. 
Okay, that plan did not work. You better have like 100% health or you're gonna have 0% health after that grab. Come, oh my God! It had an attack, then it had a combo after the attack. It gave me no chance to heal there. Jesus. And you can't really sloth this guy because he moves so much. Almost half his attacks are jumps. You can't hit a slot spell on someone that jumps. Not reliably, at least. Okay, that time it worked. Wow, he just went for the jump attack so soon. I guess when you throw in, like, all that silk, that's a good opportunity, because you gotta throw the two- OR- oh! He waited till I was in no position to dodge the grab. He knew. Got hard red like you're playing a port of Tekken. I mean, I can sloth him when he's down like that, but what's the point? Okay, now I got him sloth. Wait. It didn't work? Yeah, I don't see the icon there. Yeah, that's a case of it not dodging. Oh, God. I'm stuck. Stuck. That's the first time that attack got me. Like, normally, if I'm in burst counter, the silk webs go through my body. I'm getting real fucked up by this boss. Nothing I do works now. <laughs> Because now the fight just goes a bit longer than I hoped. Because I can't brute my way through. Like, if I didn't have barrier, that probably would have been a kill. Before the fight even starts. And look at that, I'm making so many mistakes, I'm already dead. Well, if not for quick change. your stamina once it's over god I'm just tilting hard shit oh that was close no 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 oh 100% damn it. Oh my! Are you fucking kidding me? He kills me in midair. Oh, that's a first. For this fight, anyway. Like, he got me as I was coming back to the fight. Unreal. Oh, 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 we might be here all day. I don't want to be here all day. I know you don't want to be here all day. Oh, 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 it got me again. 
And again, I still have a barrier. But God, that chomps through the whole thing. Okay, you're not giving me the silk grab again. Oh wow, jump in immediately. I'm surprised he even had a chance to heal that time. Usually it doesn't let you do anything. Sadly, my, uh, my H, my, uh, key recovery has gone back down again. I find Namahage works really well against this boss when it's already on the ground. Okay, maybe I should find an opportunity to heal. Barrier. Also, I gotta stop confusing barrier with the talisman that's keeping me from taking damage. Because it seems similar, but they're not. Okay, you're not eating my whole yokai shift right away. I won't let you. Okay, uh, that was close. Okay, I just noticed it's doing more combos than ever. Or maybe it's just my mind playing tricks on me. Wouldn't put it past the game to do that now. Okay, this is as close as I've gotten so far. No, no, no. The quick change. Did, did, I didn't have a quick change, did I? Did it expire? Or did mine get used up? But that was my closest attempt. I'm not giving up against this boss. There's no way. <laughs> I won't let it happen. Oh my god, I gotta get some food because I'm starving. I haven't really eaten all morning. I just had like two cups of coffee. And this boss is warming me up faster than the caffeine ever did. It's just amazing how well this boss tracks your movements. Well, it's actually very terrifying how well it does that. At least it's on fire, so that helps. I didn't think I'd hit it enough times to get it on fire. Nice. I don't know exactly what smashing that Emrita spike on its back helps. Maybe it makes it easier to stun? Seems that way. Alright, now it's for keeps. You ain't get me this time. There's just no way. I've come this far. Oh, 
Oh, is this it? I think I might have a chance. Got him. Finally. That took way more time than it needed to. Holy shit. <laughs> okay, and that stone is still not full yet. It's on its way, though. So there's that. Oh, wow. That, that fight took a lot out of me. At least we got that Twilight mission confirmed as beaten. And for that, we get, like, a whole lot of stuff, including another Summer's Candle. So while that mission has changed, not that I care. <laughs> okay, we don't want to do Palace of the Damned yet. I'd say the next mission we do is Insatiable Bloodlust. So there you go. Alright, let's stop the video here. Because I need to calm myself down and in the next episode we'll go to level two level insatiable bloodlust recommended level 233 see you there everyone thanks for watching